Hey everyone, happy Friday. I'm Kenna. Thank you so much for joining me and welcome to the Echo Paradox demo. Guess what? The multiverse is real, but apparently devoid of life. We will be taking on the role of a phase link research group employee. Our task is to venture into unknown parallel universes in a quest to find any remnants of human existence. I don't have a good feeling about this. I don't think this is a job I really want, but I will be leaving a link to this demo down in the description box for you all below. But without further ado, let's uh, let's go explore some parallel universes. Here we go. The future begins with you. I don't think I agreed to that, but okay. A very white, sterile room. Attention all pioneers of science and adventurers at heart. This is an official invitation from the Phaselink Group. Your gateway to the unknown. We've made a breakthrough in quantum physics and discovered alternate universes. But here's the twist. Oh. They're all empty. Why, you ask? Well, that's exactly what we need you to help us find out. Join our initiative today to explore these mysterious worlds. Unravel their secrets and be part of a monumental journey that redefines the unknown. Don't just dream about new worlds, discover them. Join Phaselink today and be part of history in the making. Tune in to your sense of adventure and call us right now. Terms and conditions apply. No guarantees of returning the same person or at all. May experience side effects including, but not limited to, existential crisis, sudden understanding of quantum mechanics, or an overruling urge to tell everyone the time is an illusion. Phaselink is not responsible for any lost socks, minds, or universes during your adventures. Call at your own risk. Can I turn that off? Okay, apparently not. Um, did that say, like, you might not return as the same person? Okay, really quick, I need to check my mouse settings. Hold on. Okay, I guess that's a little bit better. All right, so let's examine. Uh, can I just put it back? Okay, okay, here we go, reading. Uh, Dear Candidate 406, congratulations and welcome to the groundbreaking volunteer science program. We are thrilled to have you on board as a valued member of our team, contributing to an exciting breakthrough in the field of science. Your commitment to this program is greatly appreciated and we look forward to working together to achieve remarkable results. As a participant in this program, it is crucial to remember that you have signed a non-disclosure agreement in DA to ensure the confidentiality of the cutting edge research and developments you will be exposed to. This NDA underscores the significance of the work we are undertaking, and we trust that you will honor this commitment throughout your participation in the program. Throughout the program, please be ready to receive important announcements and updates via your assigned room number. Meals and accommodations have been arranged for your convenience, and we kindly ask that you adhere to the schedule provided to ensure the smooth progression of the program. Best regards, research team. The prompt there needs to be lower on the screen. Just saying. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay. I still think I need to mess with it. Hold on. There we go. I was, I just realized in the options I was messing with the FOV and not the mouse sensitivity. Doesn't matter. I fixed it. We're good. I think we're okay. <laughs> Which does that, does that change? Okay. That does change the prompt down there at the bottom. I messed with the FOV. So that's on me. I take back what I just said. My bad. Okay. So testing room zero three. Ooh, all these people are uh, here, huh? Do you have a run? We're being watched. Employees only behind this point. Beyond this point. My God, can I read? No, I cannot. Okay, where's testing room 303? Yeah. Okay, well, obviously I cannot leave because I'll need a key card. Visitors, please report to office before entering. I kind of want to enter, but I was... I guess that's the plant. It almost looks like the shadow of a person. But I think it's supposed to be the plant. Oh my god, I'm already seeing things. Okay, we need to go get tested, I think. 
kind of like these posters oversee the direction of the world we are pioneers they're kind of cute uh well, that's the bathroom i see a green light down there anything no it's it is quite literally a bathroom okay here we go let's go get tested Whoop! Moshi Moshi. Yes, hi. Candidate uh, 406. Yes. Welcome to the program. Oh. I'm the supervisor for Group 4, and we are way behind schedule. So let's get started with the welcome message. Play tape. Oh. Oh my god, we get a movie! Welcome to Orientation Day. Feeling a bit jittery about your first excursion? That's perfectly natural. Here's what you need to know. Our artifact grants access to diverse fragments of reality. Worlds that are similar to our own. Each trip lands you in a different world, making it impossible to predict your destination. But fear not, you won't venture alone. This nifty device will allow us to send you brief messages from Phaselink headquarters, so guard it with care. Upon arrival, activating all of the keys on the artifact will send you back home. Make the most of your journey. Gather intel and be prepared to share it during the debriefing. Best of luck out there. <clears throat> when you're ready, proceed through the door ahead. And good luck. Ooh, can I take this? Oh, no. Apparently not. Oh, yes. Ha! Huh. Alright, let's go. Hi. Oh, are you on a are you on a time limit? Oh, you're here too. Hi. You want to look at your watch? Okay, no. Let's do this. Let's go do stupid things and be big damn heroes and all of that. Bye guys. It was nice meeting you. Ta-ta for now. I'm sure this won't have any serious consequences whatsoever. Am I getting paid? <gasps> Ooh. Oh, they're all just standing there looking at us. Oh, wow, cutscene. Yeah, let's go run into the shiny light. Ooh. So pretty. Oh my god. Ugh. I need a Dramamine. <gasps> I hear wind chimes, I think. Whoa. Okay, I don't know what that was. Okay, we got flashlight. Cool. I do not notice any battery management. What's up? No signal. Keys located for no signal. Okay, well. I guess we just keep on heading straight, everybody. Let's go. Hmm? HQ to 406, we are here with you. Stay focused and keep moving. Well, I would if you would stop interrupting me. Danger. So somebody's been here before, right? That's what these blocks would indicate, right? These, these red blocks. Let's go. Sure it was a deer, right? We're in the woods. Probably some cute little woodland creature. Let's just run. Let's see what our stamina is. Mm. Found one. I 
guess let's just... Uh, yes. The artifact is nearby. Find the keys to return to HQ. I, yeah, no kidding, it's nearby. I just picked it up. Oh, oh, there's, there's the thing. There's the artifact. That's what they were talking about. Yeah. Just big and sitting there like a damn monolith. Can't go in there. Ugh. Those don't look natural, right? Hmm. That looks kind of un making me a little uncomfortable. Okay, so... Artifact. I'm assuming they go, like, in here. What? Place four keys on the pedestal to activate the artifact. Should we just go ahead and... There you go. Have one. Hot damn. I'm not... Okay, this is like an incredibly small thing. I, I apologize. Um, every time I mess with something, my flashlight gets put up. Oh my god. Okay, my bosses are annoying as hell. Investigate the house. Find out what happened to the occupants. Okay. I mean, I wasn't aware there were occupants, but I was going to investigate it. locked okay let's this is a big ass house yes i was assuming there would be uh, okay you know what detecting multiple keys inside the house fantastic can i please just do my job i i'm you said to investigate the house that's what i'm going to do which would indicate at some point i'm going to probably come across the keys i don't need you to hold my hand Time to die. Well, we'll see about that. I'm sure it's just a deer. Ooh, oh, pizza. <sighs> Do we? Can't I can't read that? Okay. I'm walking all over your couch though. This is a nice big old kitchen. I like it. Uh oh. They said I'm going home, but I am home. Okay. Are we just having like a centralized earthquake here? What the hell? I see. Daddy, mommy, me, friend, mm, child. Shut. Yeah. I can't let you in. It's locked. Sorry. Okay, I feel like grays are going to show up any minute now. Alright, let's see what doors we can open. Not that one. Ooh, bathroom. Do giants live here? I mean, I'm not the tallest person. I'm pulling about a five, six thereabouts, but, uh, damn dog. I think those are all the doors down here. Hmm. <gasps> Keep looking outside because I feel like. Oh, no, that's just a post. Okay, never mind. <sighs> Laundry room upstairs. I, I just, it's so bothersome to me. Oh. Damn it, I hate when that happens. Put 
please tell me this. Holy crap, this is a bit. Room. <laughs> oh, how do I get in there? Uh, alien, are you okay? Poor fella. I think he just... Oh my god. Wait. Oh. I feel like this is where the toilet should be. <laughs> uh, is this blood? Oh, dear god, please let it be blood. Why is the toilet paper on the floor? Oh my god. Yeah. I've seen this poster before. Party Island, full moon. Little girl, do you have any? Ooh, okay, wow. Well, that's a bummer. Is there anything else I can open? Doesn't. Okay, so we've got a key. in that room there. I'm not, okay, wait a minute. It's saying there should be Dude, where's that effing, okay, am I, am I losing my mind? Or is that, okay, that's just another closet door. Okay, never mind. I thought that was a door. I was like, where on earth is that door supposed to be? Okay, I'm in here. Oh no. Well. Yeah, that's not just vines. That's like a alien worm. Fantastic. Gross. Okay, well I saw you. Ew, you're leaving it behind. What is this key? Okay, well, we saw potentially a gray crawl under the bed. I, I, I suspect they're leaving those wormy worm things around, which is gross. Okay, how much you want to bet? The key. Well, bam, let me in. Okay, you know what? Y'all are just gonna have to wait. Oh, Q, that's right. Whoop. Whoop. Document ID CC-2024-001, oh, May 15th, 1985. Date of discovery, August 11th, 1972. Subject, crop circle phenomenon investigation. In recent weeks, a series of intricate crop circles have emerged across the rural landscape of redacted, baffling both locals and experts alike. These geometric patterns, spanning several meters in diameter, have been meticulously crafted with no sign of human intervention or mechanical tampering. The design range from simple concentric circles to complex fractal shapes, leading to a surge in speculation about their origins. While some attribute these formations to redacted activity or natural phenomena, others argue they are the work of skilled hoaxers. Despite numerous theories, the true source of these enigmatic crop circles remains shrouded in mystery, sparking intrigue and debate among the curious and the skeptical. Department State, United States of America. Department of State. Okay. Give me that. I was fully expecting to whip around and there'd be an alien waiting for me to probe me. Crop circles appear overnight. UFO spotted downtown. <gasps> Another picture. Oh, it's like the same one. A little bit clearer. Can I? Okay, this is from May 12th, 1981. Okay, so this is, this is a few years before the one we just read. Date of discovery, November 24th, 1955. Subject, interdimensional beings. 
In a groundbreaking revelation, researchers have posited a compelling theory that links the elusive Bigfoot sightings to interdimensional phenomena, suggesting that these cryptids might, in fact, be extraterrestrial beings. According to Dr. Redacted, a leading expert in anomalous studies, numerous sightings of Bigfoot coincide with regions experiencing unusual electromagnetic disturbances and unexplained disappearances. The theory proposes that Bigfoot creatures possess the ability to traverse between dimensions, hence their fleeting appearance and elusiveness. There, this interdimensional travel could explain the lack of concrete evidence in the creature's seemingly supernatural capabilities, such as vanishing without a trace. As more advanced technology is employed to investigate these phenomena, the possibility that Bigfoot is an alien visitor navigating between worlds gains traction, reshaping our understanding of, of both cryptozoology and extraterrestrial life. Mm-hmm. So Bigfoot's an alien, huh? That's what we're going to go with? All right, so we got one. A ring a ding ding. Oh wait, very interesting layout. I'm coming. Something weird's gonna be down here. <laughs> Thanks. Coming. Oh, aren't those the... Whoop! I don't think that's yours. Put it down. Wow. Just... Being total shitheads about it, huh? Um, can I get out this door? No. There's not another one. That leads to the bathroom. Is this door unlocked now, by chance? No. Wow. There's like a big old barn. This house is huge. Can I... Okay. Oh, it's the radio up in the bedroom. Wait, no, come back. Oh yeah, I did my boss's call. Hold on. What did they, what did, re receiving strange interference. Are you encountering anything unusual? Nope. I'm all good. Nothing weird happening at all. Oh. These are the worst aliens. You, dude, what happened? Do I need to bring a first aid kit? Is it downstairs or upstairs? Okay. Okay. Where, where did these all come from? Where did these... Oh, I guess we're on that table. Uh, oh, good God. Warning, disturbance detected in the vicinity. Be on high alert. Well, great, fantastic. I will be, but I mean, there's really not a whole lot I can do. I d you didn't send me with a weapon, bunny. I don't think I'm gonna be able to charm these aliens with my sparkling personality. Did you get yourself locked in there? How? What? How? 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 What? 
Oh. I really don't like these. Well, Have you seen this man? I don't like that because it's... I, beware. Subject is dangerous. Contact police immediately. I don't like it because his eyes are all blacked out. That is creepy. He's naked. Is this the same guy? I think so. Why is everything upside down? Interesting. Everything is upside down. Okay. Don't look away. Uh, okay, so if I see that, I'm not supposed to look away, I guess. Am I barefoot? I sound like I'm barefoot. Hmm. Got some low humming. I guess let's go downstairs. I can't say I'm like a huge fan of that. That's creepy. Didn't think so. Oh. What you watching? You okay? All right. Well, I mean, go go for it, little guy. Oh my god, are we doing puzzles? Don't look away. What the hell does that even... Okay. What? Find the rest of the fuses quickly. Not safe. Returning to HQ is not a priority. Wow. Okay. Thanks, guys. Super excited about this. Dickheads. Uh-oh. Hi. I guess I'm not supposed to look like... Can I get close to you? Yeah? Can I get close? Oh. Okay. It's whatever. I mean, he kind of came and just shook me. Which, I mean, I can't say I 100% appreciate, but it's, it's... Of all the things he could have done, I'm not gonna freak out about it, you know? I think I need one more. Potentially bathroom? We're in here. Hey! Um... Okay. Now what? Can I leave? Mr. Alien Man, can I leave? Can I? Hey, look at that. Did you bring the car back? Hey, we can get out, nice. They did, okay, you know what? Unacceptable. Unacceptable. Oh, 
Let's see, I guess let's go into the big creepy barn. For God's sakes, these people are annoying. <laughs> Face ladder, press E to interact. Oh, I'm assuming it's probably gonna be up there. Really? Did I just come up here for no? I no, I did not. I came up here for a shit ton of reasons. Do I have all of them? How do I? Okay. Should we just make a run for it? Oh, maybe we should make a run for it. Hello? I cannot stay. Oh! Yeah, I gotta go, buddy. Okay. Still not off the hook for the, the car. Oh, Lord, there's another one. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Go back to the artifact, put the keys in. Yeah, no kidding. Oh! Uh. Okay, yeah, we're going. What the hell is that thing? Don't get me. Don't you get me. Whoa! I don't like your heavy, heavy breathing. I don't like that at all. Yeah, let's go. Well, that was weird. Thank you for playing the demo. Ah, oh. well, you're welcome. <sighs> Enter the multiverse of horror Halloween 2024. Well, there you go. There's, there's the predicted release date. Okay, well that was the Echo Paradox demo. I, I really like the premise of, of the multiverse being real, but going into these, these alternate universes and it just being devoid of nothing, which is an incredibly eerie and uncomfortable uh, scenario, I think. I mean, okay, listen, if it was between horrible, evil, things that wanted to kill everything it came across and those universes being empty, I'll take an empty universe. The game is obviously going to be dealing with aliens and I'm assuming that these universes are empty because the aliens have come and abducted all of them. I am all for a kick-ass alien game. I don't think this was bad necessarily. I didn't really feel, I'm trying to like sort my thoughts. I just played it. So um, I, I didn't feel crazy threatened by the alien. It was like, don't look away from it. I thought maybe we might have like a weeping angel scenario. And maybe we did because I just walked up to the damn thing and we had to stare down for a couple of seconds and then he grabbed me and shook me and then effed off to somewhere. <laughs> so I, I didn't feel like a huge threat. I think maybe... Um, maybe adding that more of a threat from the alien, uh, would be a boon to the game. Um, but I, again, I really do like the premise of, of being this kind of explorer going to these alternate universes and trying to figure out where everybody went, if anybody was there in the first place. Um, so again, not, not necessarily bad. I just think maybe a little more polishing could be applied 
But those are just my thoughts. You all can let me know what you think down below in the comments. I like hearing from you, but that is what I have for you today on this Friday. Again, I will leave a link to this down in the description box for you all, but you all have a fantastic Friday. I will probably see you again uh, on Sunday. So you all take care and I will see you then. Bye.